Welcome to Mojo 2 TV. I'm Coach Danzy, and this is, we're bringing on our College Showcase Spotlight Player. And today we have Sloan Seymour with Siena College, incoming freshman. Uh, Sloan, thank you for coming today. Appreciate yeah, you joining us. Thanks for having me, Coach. Appreciate this it. It's fabulous. Um, I know you're very busy this time of year uh, with your workouts at your school and just trying to get situated with a lot of different things. So we really do appreciate your time um, here with us. The first question I have for you, uh, Sloan, um, what was your major uh, factor for you deciding to choose Sienna? What was the biggest thing? Uh, the style of play. I mean, Coach Christian, I've, you know, I've watched his uh, offense a little bit at the Mount, and I've seen you know, guys that are similar to me thrive in that system, and it's just something you know, I wanted to be a part of. Okay, now is that system, what would you compare it to? Is it fast paced? Is it slow down? Like Boston stuff, this old school 80s, or is it like the run and gun, like the Lakers? Or is yeah. it somewhere between? I mean, it's, it's fast paced and it's run and gun too, but it's just mayhem on the court and mm -hmm. just creating, you know, chaos for other teams. And it's just, you know, something that a lot of people haven't seen before. Right, right. So is it, so you were saying then much of it is predicated on defense? More so to, to create that type yeah, of... Yeah, uh, just pressuring the ball and, you know, pressing full court for 40 minutes. Wow. You know, that's wow. what it's based on. Yeah, so, yeah. yeah. Now, with your long length arms, I'm pretty sure yeah. you can uh, d d d d disrupt the passing lanes a lot. Yeah. You know? <laughs> All right, let's... Now, let's... Uh, Nick, can you bring in a clip of, of Sloan? We got like four or five clips of you last year shooting that jump shot, that sweet jump shot of yours. We want to show some of the people um, in the that, area who haven't seen it, how sweet that jump shot is. Uh, smooth release. Is it still smooth like that, Sloan? Of course. <laughs> you can shoot with people in your face. That's going to be big time. Guys going to be a little taller now at next level, D1 level. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm pretty sure you're practicing that as well. Uh, playing defense, uh, something you did, blocking shots, uh, mid-range area shots. I mean, you, I, mean I, I could go on and on. I'd be spending too much time uh, cutting your tape of last season or the year before. But uh, that's just a little bit for the fans to see who might not have seen those, uh, seen you play. But um, what, what are some of the things that you, you put in your arsenal this year, the next level, that can help you be more effective on the court? Yeah, definitely, uh, you know, mobility-wise, just being, you know, big and mobile, you know, run up and down the floor and, you know, at 6'9", just, you know, shooting the ball and having, you know, have to have people chase me and, you know, getting in the weight room a lot with, mm -hmm. the, new, with the strength coach Ian. So that's definitely helped me. And, um, you know, just being, you know, mismatch nightmare and, you know, thriving that mayhem style of yeah. play that we have. Yeah, I like that. Like you said, yeah. mismatch nightmare. That's um, that's that's kind of scary because 6'9", and you can shoot the way you do, stretching the floor out. That's, yeah. I know Coach Christian got to love that possibility of seeing that, that come about um, to fruition. Now, uh, playing at the TU Center now um, is going to be a different from playing at a high school gym that you've been used to playing at all mm -hmm. season, last season. So are you ready to take it on that 17,000-seat uh, arena and really oh, yeah, put it on there? Definitely, definitely. I just love playing you know, for the city of Albany. It's my city, so I love, you know, putting on for the city, you know, each game. You know, yeah. I get to go out, I'm just going to play my hardest, do whatever, you know. Yeah, you know this. You Coach know this. asked me to help, help the team win, so, yeah. Because yeah. you know this area loves Siena, you know what yeah. I mean? Uh, yeah, You got a big fan base, you got a lot of alumni here, mm -hmm. and they just, you know, they're going to be rooting for you because you're a local homegrown yeah. you know, player here, so it's going to be fantastic. Yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun. <laughs> All right, now, let me switch gears just a little bit. There's also a player, uh, Jaden, uh, I believe his name is Jaden, Jalen, Jalen Pickett, you play with in the City Rocks, mm -hmm. I believe, or, yeah. around the same time you played with them. Um, and he signed with Sienna as well. Can mm -hmm. you explain some of the skills that maybe other people might not know about him, what he will bring to, to Yeah, Siena? he's, well, we basically call him like a utility knife or a Swiss Army knife because you can use him in so many situations. Uh, he's a great defender. He can shoot it, you know. He can create plays for others and just dish out, you know, assists from the high post. Yeah, yeah. And, you know, he's just, you know, he can get any rebound, you know, over anybody, no matter how big they are. He's got long arms, and he's athletic, and, um, you know, he's a great knockdown shooter. So he's wow. going to be really be a useful favorite. for us. Yeah. <laughs> now, oh, I, 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 I kind of jumped the gun, but I want to say what the magic that you two will bring. You, I mean, you guys can be the start of something for Coach Christian, you know, his first year here in building, 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 mm -hmm. and possibly get to that, you know, that level that everybody wants to get to, that, you know, that NCAA yeah, tournament, definitely. you know. Um, also, I'm coming down to the end of the uh, questions, but I'm going to ask you a few more. Um, how, was your, how was your experience playing with the New York Rens down in New York City? I mean, you come from uh, the Albany area, going way back down there each, for every practice and tournaments. That had mm -hmm. to be something, but how was that experience overall? Oh, it helped me. It helped me a lot. You know, I give credit to my coach, Chris Alisi. He, I mean, he's, he's been my guy, you know, since I was like 16. So. Wow. And just, um, you know, we played a similar style that they play, you know, 
at the mount with Coach Christian. You know, we play we played fast for the Rens. We we play what we know one post guy, and then we just ran, you know, four wings, four oh, guards. So yeah. we ran up and down a lot. We pressed a little bit, and, uh, you know, we played fast. So, you know, I thrived in that system, and, you know. So you're going to be pretty much used to that type yeah, of stuff. Yeah, I'm used to, you know, <laughs> running and stuff like that. Wow, yeah. wow. Okay. Um, you also averaged 14.5 at Shaker um, your senior year. Um, you had a fabulous, fabulous season. It didn't end up the way you liked it to, but, um, you know, you, you, you did some wonderful things there. You gave us a lot to talk about on our broadcast. And, um, you know, we, 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 you know we, we, we really did appreciate you playing. I just wanted to say that yeah. personally to you. Thank you. Um, also, um, I want to talk to you about your father, Steve. He coached at CN as an assistant mm -hmm. and a couple, a couple other places like Duquesne and a few others. I've, I've, I just slipped my memory right now. But um, would that bring special emotions for you, entering the, going on campus and stepping in that gym? And I know you were young at that time, but would that bring something special to you when you go? Yeah, I mean, it's kind of it's kind of cool. How, you know, I was I was on you know the campus, you know, that young, and now I'm back again. Yeah. But yeah, definitely, you know, something special. My dad doesn't want to put you know any pressure he's just you know wants to see you know me and the team do good yeah and yeah. you know see great things happen at Siena. oh great great yeah all right um so i'm gonna end it right there now uh now your family you got your mom your father you got brothers and sisters yeah i got a brother and sister okay yeah. so they, they're young or older oh they're younger 16 so they, and 13. so they're gonna be yeah. they're ballers both of them oh uh, yeah they are oh wow yeah. so we got some yeah, some more some some more seymour's coming yeah <laughs> all right now what can you can you give us any prediction about this upcoming season for you personally and for the team? Uh, you know, we're just going to, you know, no games are guaranteed. That's a given in college. You know, you got to, you know, you got to fight out for, you know, each win. But we're just going to do whatever it takes to get a win. Just play hard each and every night. So that's, you know, basically what we can guarantee is going to happen. And my final question, I know you talked about it earlier, but I want you to go a little bit more in depth. What are some of the qualities that you like about Coach Christian? You know, like, mm -hmm. you know, you said some things about, you know, how he is. But get, can you give more about about this special coach? Yeah, he's, he's really fun to play for. You know, he's a great communicator, you know, to his players. And, um, you know, he's really positive, which helps a lot of guys. You know, if they make a mistake or they're down, you know, we just play through it. Mm -hmm. It's going to help us, you know, in the long run, just, you know, keep improving each and every day. Great. Fantastic. Thanks for coming. Yeah, so thanks Appreciate for having it. me, Coach. Yes, Appreciate sir. it. All right. Emoji2TV, sounding out. Signing out, what you say? <laughs>